So guys, let's uh, I'll talk about one of my favorite features of this uh, BMW i4 M50. Or the, or the BMW i4 in um, you know, general. And, and as you guys already know, there's a lot, there's a lot to like about this BMW car. One of, one of the the, the uh, favorite features for me is the adaptive regen. So right now I'm, I'm driving on B mode. I just got on the highway. And so I'm going to take it off B mode. Before I do that, you know, in order to be safe, I, I think what I'm going to do is just put it on on uh, another one of my favorites, which is uh, adaptive cruise, which will allow me to hands-free. And so, let's go ahead and do that right now. All right, so. There you go. And it's, you know, driving when, when you know when you get that that you know the yellow, the little yellow thing, that means it's time for you to put your hand so that you can know that you're still awake, right? And then uh, getting back to the adaptive um, regen part of it is. Um, and increase the speed right here. I'm mean, kind of. <laughs> I mean, I know it's a rainy day and whatnot, but I can drive a little bit faster than 50 miles an hour on the express. So I just in, in uh, uh, increased it right here. Again, I'm still on the hands free. And then, um, see that. Um, then I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm also still on B, so to, um, I just have to go down here and then that gets me to D and now I'm on, uh, adaptive, um, you know, regen, but again, even though I'm on a adaptive cruise, it's almost a bit re redundant, right? Because on adaptive cruise, um, the uh, car will automatically reduce its speed when it gets, you know, closer to, um, you know, traffic. And it, it does that through uh, adaptive regen. So, but in, in terms of the adaptive region, which is really what I, I had meant to uh, talk about, what I like about the adaptive region, um, you know, feature is the fact that your car actually drives like a normal car, right? When you're on, on the um, uh, highway and, and you have it on adaptive region mode, um, let's go ahead and change our change our lane right here get out of this slow lane right and I'm still on all right adaptive so I'm, I'm, I'm still on a, a adaptive cruise so your car um, I'm kind of driving a bit slow so I'm just gonna take it off cruise so your car um, drives, you know, normally. So like right now, I'm, I'm not on cruise. Once I take my foot off the uh, pedal, see that right there? It goes on adaptive because I got too close. When you get too close, then your car will uh, apply regen and then use, you know, regen to, um, you know, slow down your car. Now, if, if there's no no car in um, you know front of you. You know what will um, you know happen is is that your um, 
um, you know, Khan will, um, uh, uh, you know, continue to to roll without any re, uh, assistance, you know, normally, like is a regular car, right? I mean, it's, you know, if you, for instance, if you're going um, downhill and you uh, take your, your foot off the, uh, um, you know, pedal, guess what's going to happen? Your your car, just the pull of, um, you know, gravity is just going to pull your car all the way down. No region, no nothing. It's like, it's, it's almost like you're getting free, free uh, uh, energy, right? So, you know, so that's, that's, you know, basically the uh, crux of, um, of this, um, you know, in a situation with regards to the adaptive region, not to be mistaken with adaptive cruise. And um, both of them are really, really very good, um, you know, features to have on this car. And, um, you know, again, I can't, I can't, um, you know, complain. Um, you know about both so it is what it is i'm just gonna go ahead put this thing back on uh cruise again you see that right there Again, you know, since since this is the uh, M50, um, it's an all-wheel drive. It's you know uh, uh, X drive. So you know you're talking about it. It has two um, you know motors in the front and at the back. So it's an all-wheel drive. And I also got the uh, all um, you know season um, you know tires. It's, you know for days like this, and of course for like you know snow and whatnot. Um, so now that I'm off the, the the highway, I'm just gonna go ahead and put this thing back on B mode and just drive on B mode. When I'm when I'm off the uh, uh, express, um, you know B mode, which is the the one uh, you know pedal, is the best way to go, right? It's just it's all, it's, it's one pedal all, all pretty much all the time. You rarely, rarely ever get to uh, use your brakes. But um, on the um, you know highway, um, that's when um, I definitely have a need to um, you know. Uh, to you know, basically go on the uh, D mode, and then my regen is um, set to uh, adaptive regen mode, and so that way on the highway, the the car uh, automatically um, makes the um, regen decision you know for you, and the the regen automatically kicks in. Once you get, um, you know, close to another car that's in front of you, then your car, the, depending on how fast or you know your, you, you know, say how your, um, you know, closing speed, it will, it will, uh, pretty much, um, you know, figure out how much region to apply. If you're not, if a car, if you're uh, 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 approaching another car, but not at, at a very uh, a rapid pace then it will it will use low region low to medium region to just gradually slow you down even you know you probably wouldn't even, even feel it but then if you're if if the if if the uh, traffic build up in uh, front of you um appears to be um you know sudden then the the uh region is going to be uh pretty much uh, pretty much at the um, you know highest level and even at a point it, it might even warn you to basically use your your brakes so guys that's um you know pretty much what i got today i hope y'all 
enjoyed um, today's ride along. Take care. God bless you all. Peace out.